Good morning. So a couple of weeks ago, while I was walking around this um, village, I came across this santal tree. So I'm going to show it to you today. I mean, I have, I've always eaten the fruit, but I've never really seen the tree before. So uh, that was the first time for me. It's a, it's a huge, beautiful tree. And maybe it's like 70, 80 years old. So let's go and check out the tree. I was really excited when I first saw the tree. It was such amazing fruit and to be able to see the fruit hanging in the tree, it was really so beautiful. It just that it's such a beautiful tree. And it was that the whole tree was like filled with fruits. There was so much of central fruit hanging in the tree and it was so beautiful to see. Uh, it just made my day when I first saw this tree. Just found one fruit. So I'm going to show you how the inside of the fruit looks like. It's like all white flesh. That's why some people refer to this as uh, cotton fruit as well. So it makes sense. So it goes, so they're different segment and then yeah, you pull it out and there's a huge seed there. So it's not kind of a fruit that you chew on it. It's just sort of like uh, you suck on the fruit, okay, and the, um, the seed, throw away the seed. It has the kind of um, sweet, sour, and a bit of a uh, bitter taste. We're very lucky, different santal fruit sort of taste different. Some are more on the sour side, some are more on the um, bitter side and this has a very good balance. It's more on the sweet side and then a bit of sour and a, a very very little bit of uh, bitterness. So this is a pretty amazing tree that it produces really really amazing fruit. There are actually a lot of ways to eat um, santal fruit. This is one of it. Soy sauce, light soy, a dark soy and putting a bit of sugar. If you like something spicy, chili paste and like sambal, just sambal paste, just add on it. Sweet, sour, spicy, bitter. You get all the element and also the saltiness from the uh, soy sauce. So it just, it's just the fruit that you get a very nice natural taste of the fruit as well as the taste of the soy sauce and also the chili. You can um, eat with salt, peel off the skin and just that like dip into salt or just rub the salt around the fruit and just eat it you can also pickle the fruit like for example maybe a week or two weeks in salt water and then just take it out and just straight eat it it'll be nicely pickled and some of the fruit also can be cooked as well it goes well with chicken so like stir fry so if you don't want to add anything to the fruit no worries just eat it just peel the fruit or just cut open you can just eat the middle part of the fruit or you can just peel and just have a bite have a bite of the fruit that's about as simple as that you don't have to add anything so this is another way of doing it you just shred the fruit cut in tiny pieces and all that and then same stuff as well dark soy light soy um, sugar if you want to add some chili yeah add that on you can even do add cut chili as well and give it a nice stir yeah that's about it it's just as simple as that and i like this way because um the soy as well as the chili the sugar really get absorbed into the fruit it's like a complete salad fruit salad for me and i really enjoy eating this fruit if you ever come across this fruit do try it out just grab one and just try it out it's such an amazing fruit thanks for watching see you in the next video